basically hiked Acadia and thought about this plan and then eventually wrote it down and here I am two years later. Ellen Finn has been a Bar Harbor resident for over 30 years. After seeing a need for visitors and locals to find a ride to the top of Cadillac Mountain, she decided to take matters into her own hands with a new business opportunity. You know, a nice day and a sunset, you'd want to just go in the park and see the sunset. But when the park started the reservation system, you couldn't do that anymore. Acadia National Park changed their reservation system in 2021, requiring advanced vehicle reservations to access the Cadillac Summit Road. Finn's new service offers first-come, first-served shuttle rides to and from the summit all day long on a sprinter van she calls Bessie. I'm basically driving up the mountain uh, sunrise to sunset every hour with a midday break. I leave Bar Harbor at the top of the hour. I drive up to the summit, drop off there, and then pick up folks at the top at the half hour. Finn says that reservation systems like this are happening at national parks all across the country. I knew it was going to happen here eventually, uh, but when it did, I said, you know, I want to be the first person to uh, get that shuttle running. Cadillac Mountain draws in a significant amount of tourism and has been called the gem of Acadia. You know, there's places of power all around the world, and I think Cadillac is one of those places for sure. The shuttle can fit over 15 people at a time and is dog friendly. Finn says she hopes to do her part to make local and visitors' experiences in Acadia simple and easy. In Bar Harbor, Grace Blanchard, ABC7 and Fox 22 News.